Our guest today is Mr. Murli Dharan from Chennai, India. He is a choreographer, director of Broadway style musical production called The Iconic Avatar. And they will be performing on July 24th at Littleton High School to raise funds for Vision 8. So we are going to talk to Mr. Murli Dharan how challenging it is to choreograph and direct 50 actors and dancers. Mr. Murlidharan, welcome to our studio. Namaste. Namaste. And uh, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. So, the first question, of course, is to when we see a small production, you know, two dancers, three dancers, or, you know, smaller plays, we find it very challenging. But how you choreograph 50 actors and dancers, how challenging it is? See, basically, to choreograph uh, a dance production is not easy. And uh, especially like Ramayana, Mahabharata, you know, we have a lot of um, intense uh, characters. And uh, if, if you want to um, highlight their qualities, and also the characters on the stage it's you have to first you have to go through the story first and you have to teach especially in foreign countries it's very difficult to teach them um, our Puranic stories because they don't know uh, what is Ramayana so, uh, and what is Mahabharata a lot of the people a lot of uh, children mm -hmm. so we have to teach them first what is uh, Ramayana what is Mahabharata and to choreograph 50 dancers, of course, it's a challengeable thing, but this is uh, my almost 18th production. Mm -hmm. So this is not my first production. So what are some of the other productions you have produced? So I have produced uh, almost uh, Silapadigaram, Sense Beyond, uh, Sivagami in Sabadam, and Ramayana, uh, Yajna Seni, a lot of productions in my you know um, list actually mm -hmm. and uh, for Svagami in Sabadam I have used almost 120 artists in India so the uh, very famous uh, newspaper Hindu the mm -hmm. Hindu sure. they've given a review uh, as zero error program mm. and when that was produced it was uh, two years before two years before. Two years so before. now let's uh, tell us a little bit more before we get into further discussion yeah about the iconic avatar what yeah. is the story and what is the theme iconic avatar is based on ramayana based on ramayana's rama's story lord rama so how he born in ayodhi and uh, what is you know what are all the see where the in puranic story we have uh, they have shown examples how to live our life, how to live our life. So in American society also they are believing Indian um, mythology and also they are, they are, they are following our, our customs. Be uh, means uh, one for one man, one wife. Hmm. Okay, so Rama was the example. He never married any other woman in his life, the, throughout the life. So somewhere I was reading about this iconic avatar. Yeah. And, um, it was mentioned there that he's going to portray uh, Lord Rama, yeah. someone with uh, courage and calm. Of course. So of course. how do you bring this element in? Um, so it is actually, if you go through Rama in a story, Valmiki mentioned Rama in a different uh, view. Mm -hmm. And a uh, lot of people written about Rama. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you talk about Kambar in Tamil, Yes, he has, he has uh, uh, mentioned Rama in a different way. And that's the, your play is based on his words. Yes, his I'm, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now, um, also, there are some other elements. So, the choreography is one and also you are the director. Yeah. Now, most of the artists you are working here, they are local here, right? Yeah. And you are here only for a few days, a few weeks? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm. How many weeks are you before the production about? I am already... Um, for the past 10 days, I'm here. You are here. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, how, is it easy or difficult to deal with people who am, you have not worked before? 
see now the the te- technology is very very you know um, advanced now nowadays so if you want if you want to talk to my say my daughter is in india if i want to talk to my daughter and the face time is face time is there sure. skype is there and on a lot of you know communication is the world is become very s- small now sure. and uh, this uh, production um, last year i think uh, i met the version eight people mm-hmm. and we i we discussed about how we are going to present this show and they said okay we will come back to you uh, um, you know in the early year like uh, february only they said okay we can do this production after that they booked that so how how it has been working with the new yeah, like, artists uh, of course uh, see this is i'm not only working with uh, boston uh, uh, you know local dancers hmm. so last month i had a big program in sydney okay. and i did the yadava madava it's a different concept about lord krishna hmm. and uh, i was working with almost 70 dancers in locally you know in sydney hmm. so this, as i told you this uh, the technology is technology is very very advanced i'm using it in proper way so in skype i can meet them so i can correct all the you know wherever i am i you know will set up a time and i will correct the the choreography i will teach them uh, how to do this and how to do the expression everything mm-hmm. through this through skype i, I was uh, mm-hmm. teaching and this one i in february i sent all my video clippings to the dance teachers local teachers here yeah, okay so they started wa- uh, watching this video and i was i used to correct in face time on skype mm-hmm. so so the I mean, the work has been already going of on course, of course. and this is now you are here to yeah. to the final, final final partners yeah. and and uh, yeah. so in typical your rehearsals how many people come roughly on an average so they have a proper plan so i really appreciate the local dance teachers here they planned a, exactly very well you know mm-hmm. when to come when this group is coming when that group is coming first scene second scene they group a group b group like the like that they have separated the group mm-hmm. so it's easy for me to you know um mm-hmm. Uh, coordinate everything together so you're choreographing you're also directing the play yeah and also i'm told there is going to be some uh, multimedia presentation in corporation as well yeah so just tell us about that little bit see you are uh, you already mentioned so i'm going to present this show in a broadway musical style yes i was inspired by broadway musicals like light uh, lion king and i uh, you know um, in like it's everything they are using only night time stories bed time mm. stories mm. but in our um, culture indian culture we have everything in you know mm. so if they say some story so there will be a lesson you know uh, in in that uh, story like say 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 like uh, ravana ravana is a evil king so mm. you should not be like ravana mm. so he captured sita he, he brought to you know he actually uh, he was uh, sita was kept in a jail and uh, rama um, you know rama is a great warrior so how the warrior should be how the husband should be how you should not you know mm. uh, be in your life like that everything in ramayana so i thought i when i saw this uh, lion king and i thought why don't we do you mm-hmm. know with our story so i started uh, my uh, productions you know i was following inspired by broadway musicals uh, broadway musical the speciality of broadway uh, broadway musicals is first music mm-hmm. okay perfect and, and you show the iconic avatar will also have a lot of musical elements of course of course, yeah, of course yeah. of course of course so the the musical uh, the music is it's a the high quality of music they are producing when they present the show and also the props 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 makes very very big difference so i can show my hand like pen i'm taking a pen like this i can do expression mm-hmm. people will understand but if i take really pen Mm. so you need not show your expression so they they'll understand so i'm using a pen sure so same like that i used to i know we, we are going to bring a big uh, boat in this uh, uh, production and anuman is going to fly on the sky so everything i'm using latest technology and the same as so if i'm not wrong i also heard that you were you will be playing the role of i'm anuman. doing i'm doing hanuman in this because hanuman is my Um, your god or oh my god, personal yes, god yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. so i'm so, doing this hanuman role okay. in this ramayana production so i have to ask this question mm-hmm. why hanuman is your favorite god uh see in um, in our shastra they're saying only three gods are sustaining in this world now okay rama uh, hanuman raghavendra 
and uh, one more okay three god okay. god god so they mm. are sustaining in this world with to protect the people from the evil mm. so some of the saint told me so you have to follow ra hanuman what then i am following okay so it's not uh, my you know actually uh, i am a, a believer of god mm. Okay. Now, this is your fourth production for Vision Age. Vision Age, yeah. Okay. And what are the other three ones you have done for Vision Age in the past? I have done Krishna for mm -hmm. them and uh, uh, Silapadigaram I did mm -hmm. and uh, one more Sivagami Sabadam okay. and uh, not uh, Silapadigaram. I did Krishna and the Kanda Puranam, it's a Lord Burga story mm -hmm. and the third one is Sivagami Sabadam. Amara Kalki is uh, Kalki is the big author mm -hmm. in Tamil and uh, his story and this is the fourth this one. is the fourth one yeah okay. how did you get involved with a vision aid vision aid see i used to come uh, us very um, very often and uh, the teachers local dance teachers they um, used to use my compositions so i have released almost 120 uh, audio albums mm -hmm. uh ex exclusively for dance field so so like, is my tell us about those uh, the 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 albums so the albums uh, if you want to perform if you want to do an arangetram or first uh, debut performance uh, in bharatanatyam so you need to have some items like alaripu jatishwaram shabdam varnam padam jabli tillana everything like that one set of item mm -hmm. so you have to present for just for uh, two hours show So I have composed almost 120 albums. Means set up one set means alari pu jati shram different different. Mm -hmm. So 120 is different. 100 and multiple uh, uh, multiply by 10 or 8 mm -hmm. like that. So I have produced mm -hmm. and I have written everything. I composed music music because I learnt music. I learnt bhardangam and uh, with my uh, lyrical knowledge, I have written so many songs for. Uh, Uh, the dancers okay. so they are taking it it's very easy for them to buy uh, cds and use because they cannot bring our artists from india for all the programs sure so that is why i was familiar here and i i think uh, mrs jayanti gadraju is a dance teacher here mm. she called me once and she introduced uh, um vision aid and uh, she explained everything about vision aid how they are serving the people and how they are doing service in india and i am also real, uh, you know really inspired and also you know um, it's a great service they are doing for this uh, the the people in india poor people and uh, why don't i support sure so now um uh, let's talk a little bit more about uh, the the play you know and the dance drama and the event so say if i am potential you know attendee into the to the dance drama and um, and i want to come when i leave the audience the auditorium after the play mm -hmm. what are the messages i will go away with what will be the four or five things that i should really watch for in the dance drama see uh, the there is uh, two ways of uh, presenting shows you know in uh, you you take you, you can say a musical program music program or dance program or drama or whatever it is whatever i i am i'm going to do so you have to sit and watch that is one way mm -hmm. whatever you want so we are giving mm -hmm. so the, i'm following the second way okay so no i understand but like what is the message like you know what what is the one a message you as a choreographer or director okay you are very you see the question is very interesting mm -hmm. so whenever you go for a movie so you want a message from the movie sometimes <laughs> yes i mean i at least i want to think of what is the message and what did i get out of this movie okay that is what i am asking you so you see if you sure. want to if if you are choosing on da drama hmm. or dance program so you want a message from the, the oh, yes okay. i i i this my personal So that is what yes, I yeah. ex the, 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 the because when I go to see a movie or play mm -hmm. or musical program, I I do go with an expectation. Yeah. And uh, so you know I do have some sort of an idea. Mm -hmm. So as a as a director, okay, as, as I will give you a correct correct answer. Okay. So we were 
talking about Broadway musicals. Right. So I try say I was doing my programs early in my early stages, like usual dance drama. Okay, drama means. Um, so to explain, so I uh, to explain some story. For for example, okay, I am Murali Dhan. I born uh, to someone, mm -hmm. and I am here to perform. Okay, this is the message. So I will explain mm -hmm. everything in song, and uh, the people can't understand that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so same like that. Broadway musicals inspired by Broadway musicals. I was using animations. Animation means. Um, I have a separate artist mm -hmm. to draw how this Ramayana period was. Mm -hmm. Okay, how the buildings were, the architecture, how, mm -hmm. and also what are the costumes they used. So I did all all the research before my production. So be, the people you will get the message how they lived mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. those days. Excellent. One. Now second, and Rama. I told you he married only one woman. Mm -hmm. So you, sh if you marry other woman, you will be in pr trouble. Mm -hmm. So you are getting the message, second message. Okay. And how the Puranic, what is the richness of Puranic, Puranic, and the, you know Puranic stories, and uh, um, how the saints they lived in the, their their life in, in previous days, those days, everything you can understand. Excellent. And this all going to be in English, right? Of course. Uh, so the Bible, the 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 songs uh, uh, written by Kambar, it's Tamil. But we are going to give a caption, you know, uh, in for each and every song, like a meaning. You will definitely. Mm -hmm. My productions, even this uh, English audience, they will understand. Okay, excellent. So no doubt in that. Okay, excellent. Now tell us a little bit about yourself. You know, you are based in Chennai. Yeah. And. Um, uh, so how did you get into music? How did you get into these uh, musical dramas and plays? Basically, I am I learned Bharatanatyam in the age of, from the age of seven, hmm. and now I am fifty two. So you don't look fifty two at all. You look like you know no. somebody in thirties. Okay, thank you so much. And uh, my sister is my senior uh, in dance uh, in dance field. She I used to go and pick her up from the dance class, and my guru. Me and my sister, they look, we look similar, mm -hmm. like twins. Mm -hmm. But uh, she said, "Why don't you dance? Why don't you learn? You learn dance, na?" I said, "No, no, I cannot." Dance. But my father said, "No, you are learning. Mm -hmm. You have, you have." So you learned Bharat Bharat Natyam. Yeah, with force only I learned Bharat Natyam. Okay, Bharat. so maybe then you were the first male person I know who does Bharat Bharat uh, Natyam. Natyam. Okay. Is it very common or it's not common at all? In India, it's very common. Okay. It's in in India, Bharatanatyam. We have a lot of styles like Bharatanatyam, Kathak, Odissi. Sure. It depends. Like yeah. Tamil Nadu, Bharatanatyam. If you go to Kerala, Mohiniyattam, Kathakali. If you go to Orissa, you, you can you can see Odissi. Odissi. Yeah. If, mm -hmm. if you if you go to North India, mm -hmm. then uh, you can see Kathak. Mm -hmm. And if you go to Andhra, you have Kuchipudi. Mm -hmm. Different different styles. Mm -hmm. so I born in brought brought up in uh, Tamil Nadu. Mm -hmm. So I. Obviously, I learned Bharatanatyam. Bharatanatyam. So you got you learned from the very Bharatanatyam. Yeah, yeah. And then how did you get into the music. right the the music and uh, yeah. So he, as a dancer, uh, my guru advised, why don't you learn music? Hmm. I slowly started m learning music from my guru. His name is Madhuri Seyaturaman. Um, and once I learned music, and he advised, why don't you go and learn Mridanga? Because you should know what is the you should know the nuances of rhythm and everything. So I learned Mridangam also. So I learned uh, music for almost 12 years, Mridangam for almost 10 years, and dance almost for 17 years. There is no team for me. Okay. So <laughs> now, uh, so now in Chennai, all you do is music, dance. There is no other life for you. Just this is all you do. No, I have a family. No, I mean I'm talking about professional. Professionally, I I have taken uh, this uh, field as my profession. Okay. And in family, uh, what about your wife? Is she my wife is also a dancer. She's also running a school there. And uh, mm -hmm. whenever I'm not there, she's taking care of the school. Okay. And children? My daughter is also a, a dancer. She's also coming for this production. She's taking a part of Sita okay. in this. Last uh, production she did as a Sivagami, it's a main role, mm -hmm. and in this production Sita she is doing. Excellent. Now, um, 
uh, how many and this particular show like uh, iconic avatar mm -hmm. uh, i'm told that uh, it has been staged in uh, new zealand yeah australia yeah. in india the first program was uh, you know the my, i i did this uh, iconic avatar in sydney mm -hmm. sydney music festival um it's a very big uh, very prestigious and big pr uh, festival in sydney uh, i think uh, two years before i've done that and uh, after that uh, this year i did this same production in uh, new zealand and in december season i i think three to four programs i did in chennai excellent now um i have to ask you this question uh with all these modern technology and you know the the audios and videos and youtube and all these digitally everything yeah. available 24/7 yeah. uh in that context how do you look at the future of uh, life dance dramas and musical programs and dance programs definitely we see uh, uh, i i always i like uh, the new technologies okay so for example um, last year i believe i i think um, i was in canada the dance teacher she was asking me she was requesting me to record a or a song a song around for 10 15 minutes so i have recorded the whole song from canada and my musicians were playing there mm -hmm. so i have recorded it so i was watching from here in from my monitor i've corrected everything from the singer the rhythm player violinist flute and also the chorus everything i did within 3 days i've got the master sure so definitely uh, the technology is very good for uh, so the technology has also enhanced the quality of production of course of course because in, yeah. in the, yeah. the the voice and yeah. the audio yeah. and all this stuff yeah. how it has impacted the the attendance at the programs many people say you know what i can just stay at home and watch the video or you know watch something else and there's no need for me to go to, to, to no no to there is a big difference between uh, you know this and that so if you sit and watch we so i can reach uh, watch videos and have huge programs in youtube obviously i can watch and i can keep small speakers but once you go to the theater it's different right the total ambience is different and the definitely the there will be a difference like you know if you watch the movie in youtube that that's i can give only 10 marks if you go to the movie definitely you know and sure. the marks you can you can like we can score by, by watching that movie definitely there is a different big so this this technology is not going to eat away the audience 100% no 100% no 100%, no, no, 100%. Sure. you go to musicals you know uh, um, in new york still the people are coming and sitting they want to see live program excellent uh well uh, thank you very much for your uh, your time thank and you, uh, looking forward to the program thank you thank you so much and uh, all the best thank you i must uh, um my sincere thanks for you know this interview thank and you. my sincere thanks for wish and i for inviting me and uh, you know present this show along with local dancers i really respect that thank, thank you so much sure.